you take someone like um, Paul Ehrlich. So he's been promoting catastrophism for decades. It's not like he literally wants to be ruler of the world, but he has a deep hostility toward human life, uh, specifically human impact on nature. And what he's devoted his life to doing is spreading these anti-human, uh, these anti-human impact ideas throughout the society. And in particular, the goal that our goal should be to eliminate human impact on earth. So that's the value he's talking about. And then this, this, what I call delicate nurture assumption, right? So the earth exists in this delicate nurturing balance. And so our impact will destroy us. And so the, the net view that you get from this is human impact is a immoral and B self-destructive. So, so it's, you know, if you were to put it in like religious terms, it would be thou shalt not impact nature. And if you do, then the nature God will, will punish you, will send you to hell. That's really, and so he's spread this everywhere, right? He spread this everywhere and, and others like him have spread this everywhere. And again, it's not like they had a specific goal in mind. I mean, they wanted to ascend to the top of their profession, but there's a lot of just hatred of human being. I think there's a lot of human beings. I think there's a lot of envy involved. But whatever was involved there, they've spread that everywhere and people have accepted it unthinkingly. And then sometimes people will, once you start to spread it, people will spread it even more for their own goals. So for example, in the US, certain and other places like left-wing politicians saw this idea of anti-human impact as very good for anti-capitalist goals, because yeah. if human impact is bad, then you get to control everyone. So they put it all in the educational system. But again, not that they had this grand plan where they would get one specific benefit themselves, but it's more like they want power. This is convenient. This this is kind of confirms their prejudices. And so what we've had is the whole, what I call knowledge system. Uh, this is the system of institutions that we rely on for expert knowledge and guidance. It's been saturated by this view that it's that human impact is evil. Our goal should be to eliminate it. And if we don't, it's going to destroy us. And that infiltrates the sciences and people start to operate on that. 